Hello and welcome. Let's look at Y2 T19 physics pass question number 5. Which of the following instruments can be used to compare the magnitude of charges on two given bodies? A. Electrophorus B. Ebonite rod C. Gold leaf electroscope D. Proof plane So for us to understand this, let's explain what these instruments are used. Electrophorus is a device that is used in transferring and storing charges so that is what you use electrophorus to do uh, ebonite rod is a device that you can use to make negative charge by rubbing a specialized vulcanized rubber with animal fur so once you rub a rubber with animal form you produce negative charge using ebonite rod whereas proof planes are devices that can be used to safely transfer electrostatic charge you want to safely transfer electrostatic charge from one body to another you use proof planes so from one body to another that's what you use uh, proof planes for but this very gold leaf electroscope is an instrument used for the detection and testing of small electric charge so you could use it to detect and text electric charge but it has to be small electric charge so if you are drawing this very one go little electroscope it has a structure like this that will have the brass disc and it is then connected down here after having what we call the insulating plug you have what we call the brass rod you know the up there you have the brass disc or here you have the brass loss rod here is what we call the metal case and here is what we call the very gold leaf and finally you need to take charges to the ground so this is what we call the gold leaf electroscope the metal case this very metal case in this gold leaf electro um, electroscope is normally connected to the earth so we call it it is added to prevent the accumulation of charges due to external influence the leaf is the sensitive part of the instrument. This position shows the presence of charges in the discarded rod. So we can easily use it to compare the magnitude of charges in two bodies. So with that, we're going to pick C as the answer. So I want you to make research on this. And if you have any comment, drop it in the comment section. Let's look at it together. Thank you. Please hit the subscribe button and the bell icon.